hi guys welcome back again to my youtube channel so today um i'm just going to do something a bit different i'm going to talk about how to become sexy or how to feel sexy how to look sexy you name it how to be sexy and i know that this is a topic that we often avoid especially in kenya and africa people are hypocritical yeah when you, you when you make such a video everybody judges you everybody says things about you if you're a sex coach eh, lo and behold that's not something african society ever ever wants to venture into but i am not here as a sex coach or a sex guru no i'm here all about self-motivating women and even men to feel sexy and the reason i'm doing this is because valentine's day is in the corner and there are some people who are feeling like oh what am i who am i why am i feeling like this well don't worry if you want to feel sexy, even if you do not have a sexy body or what the world considers a sexy body, stay tuned because that is what I'm going to talk about today. I know that a lot of us pretend, judge and whatever, but in the background, we are busy searching like how to be sexy. Please make me sexy. <laughs> how what i can do to make me sexy and all manner of weird things that's what we are doing or googling behind the backgrounds but really don't want to talk about it especially here in kenya and in africa in general so don't worry i'm here for you guys i'm here i'm here to teach you how to be sexy so relax chillax and let's just get into the video in case you're curious about where i got this fabulous and crazy and unique makeup look well I did a video all about it. You can go check it in the description below or up there, or probably it will pop up at the end of this video. So let's get into the video. I also decided to change the setup, like where I normally film from, because I was like, heck, uh, why not be comfortable? Why not just sit on my bed instead of moving things around every single day just to film? Okay, so and if you haven't yet subscribed, before we, feel, before we feel sexy, make sure that you subscribe to my channel. I normally post content every single week. And I actually have two channels. For those of you who don't know, I also have a vlog channel. But I'm talking too much. And you all want to be sexy before Valentine's Day and for the rest of your lives. So let's just get into the video. And I'm just going to go step by step so into the things that I'm 100% sure. But in order for you to feel, feel sexy, sexy, you definitely have to feel happy and good. You can't keep feeling happy and good without you can't just go to feeling sexy without feeling happy and good you know like there's no way you can be sad and sexy if you know what i mean so the first thing you need to do is to make yourself feel happy and the first thing you need to know to do is actually to go ahead and surround yourself with people who make you happy that's just the first step and then followed by that one of the tips i'm going to give you to make you to make sure that you're feeling sexy is to dress sexy yes it's been proven once you dress sexy you will automatically feel sexy so even if you're not the kind of person to wear like a sexy dress like a short mini or you know expose your boobs and all that i personally am not the kind to like wear things that are exposed you can wear sexy lingerie or sexy underwear inside your outfit you can wear the baggiest outfit the most horrendous outfit to people but if you have like sexy underwear inside only you yourself know you'll automatically feel sexy believe you me so i believe that if you do wear sexy something sexy whether the underwear or the outfit definitely you will feel sexy so go ahead and purchase that sexy underwear or go ahead and purchase that mini dress and put it on even if you're in the house you'll automatically feel okay, sexy i'm going to give you in order to feel sexy is actually to go ahead and purchase that makeup and put it on yes makeup is not actually something that's supposed to make you look different no it's supposed to actually enhance how you look so even if you normally don't wear makeup on a day to day or even if you've never tried it just just try it just go and purchase makeup and maybe go to a professional and have your face done it will automatically make you feel sexier because it will bring out probably the feminine side in you and um yeah 
you'll be sexier and you'll feel happier. So I know a lot of people who actually don't put on makeup, especially here in Africa. I know a lot of us do not put on makeup. But I can assure you that the day you'll actually put on makeup, that's why we still put on makeup on our wedding days. Because whether we, we don't put on makeup at home, but the day we, we are actually on our wedding days, most of us or 90 in fact i think 100 percent of us actually put on makeup whether we we love makeup or not because it makes you look be not better that's wrong it enhances your facial features and makes you feel happier and just look good and therefore as a result or as an end result it will make you look sexier and feel sexier so go ahead and use makeup to feel sexier and on top of that makeup, I'm going to mention one specific thing that will make you feel really actually, sexy. Actually, lipstick, red lipstick. Red lipstick has been scientifically proven to actually, you know, turn men on. And what is the meaning of sexy? Sexy is actually, um, you know, trying to attract like the opposite sex, basically. It's not for yourself most of the time. Okay, yes, it's for yourself in this case sometimes. But uh, most of the time, it's supposed to attract, you know, heading towards that direction but <laughs> so basically red lipstick go ahead and put on that red lipstick it will definitely make you look sexy and feel sexy so it's been proven by scientists and personally i do use it a lot if i want to feel sexy and boost my confidence yeah so go ahead and use the red lipstick on the makeup and part. Uh, yeah another suggestion i'd give to you is to try a smoky eyeshadow look and if you don't know how to do a smoky eyeshadow look i actually did a video on doing a smoky eyeshadow look so look for that video smoky eyes are considered sexy i don't know by who but they are considered sexy so go ahead and try a smoky eyeshadow look so take yourself to the makeup artist ask for a smoky eyeshadow look and finish it off with a red lipstick you'll definitely look and feel sexy so go ahead because it creates like an air of mystery you know smoky eyes have blacks and you know whites so they actually create an air of mystery around you and uh you'll catch lots of attention believe you me and if you don't want attention you just want to feel sexy for yourself go ahead girl and try the smoky eyeshadow look definitely it's going to make you look and feel sexy. that i'm going to suggest to you is actually to purchase uh either a movie a novel or you know something that's going to stimulate your senses in terms of uh, your mind yeah a sexy novel a sexy book a sexy and i don't mean sexy like pornography and <laughs> oh, that's not what i mean i mean sexy like romance because it's going to to create certain feelings in you that will actually make you feel happy you know fun and sexy basically so Go ahead and read a romance novel or if you're not fan, a fan of romance novels definitely go ahead and watch a romance movie there are so many out there the notebook and all that and uh yeah tell me what <laughs> you'll feel afterwards so definitely try out romance in terms of reading a novel or either watching a romance movie and definitely it will make you feel sexy because most of the time we replace ourselves with the main characters of either the movies or the novels so in our mind we are the main character in that novel or the movie so definitely the end result of reading a romance novel or watching a romance movie is actually feeling romantic which is goes hand in hand with sexy so yeah last and final tip that i'm going to give you in order for you to feel sexy is actually to just love your body and to love yourself because definitely work towards loving yourself and loving your body then you won't have to google how to feel sexy how to feel what because anytime you're required to feel sexy you'll automatically feel sexy so just love your body as it is after all we come in all shapes and sizes long tall short fat and we love ourselves so nobody was standard nobody is like a standard measurement of what beauty is even if we want to lie to ourselves that we are have a standard there is no such thing as a standard that's why standards always change over time uh, over the course of like yeah basically over time like they're always changing like today fat is in tomorrow thin is in today what is in that is in just love yourself you're uniquely made and i'll always advocate for that you're uniquely made and i don't even advocate for this thing of people going to look like another person what the heck is that how will people watch you if you look exactly like the other person you know 
just be yourself, love yourself, and you'll automatically feel sexy. Yeah, I know that was a bit weak, but hey, a girl's gonna dig deep into this brain for content, and I hope that this Valentine's Day you'll feel sexy, be happy, be sexy, and be yourself. So make sure that you got, even if it's the slightest tip, make sure that you subscribe. And uh, by the way, guys, I'm going to be playing a certain game over to, on my vlog channel. So look out for that. It will be a one-minute game. Just me and the camera. And maybe you, if you want to join in in your head, yeah. So thank you so much, guys, for watching. I truly appreciate you. And I'll see you in my next video. Take care of yourselves. Bye. Ciao.